table. Good morning. Hi, Cruz. Good morning. My hair is different. <laughs> I changed my hair. It's still me though. Where's my ukulele? Yep. Still here. Oh, good morning, Mrs. Cleveland. Oh, I miss you. I miss all of my friends at school. Hmm. All right, we're gonna get started in just a second. We're celebrating birthdays today. I'm very excited. We're having two special birthdays in our family today. And one of the people having a birthday, oh, come on over. One of the people having a birthday, good morning, Sophie. Hi, Claire and Daniel. One of the people having a birthday is right here. This is Evie. And Evie is my daughter, and Evie is 10 today. Good morning. How are you, Evie? Good. How does it feel to be 10? I don't know. Do you feel the same as you did yesterday? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, for 10 years. So Evie is two, <laughs> two whole hands. 10. <laughs> Hi, I'm Presley and Hunter. Hi, Mrs. Mary. I was just telling Mrs. Cleveland I miss all my teaching friends. All right, Abby. What? You don't have to say it yet. But thanks for stopping by. If you want. Okay. Yeah, but you can't sit right here, though. Okay. Because there's not enough. Yeah. I, I need this uh, little spot here. Yeah. And I know Hunter is having a birthday or had a birthday. Seven. Yeah, so Evie is 10, so that's one special birthday. So that means I've been a mom for 10 years. And the other special birthday today, speaking of moms, is my mom is having a birthday today. She's not 10, um, but yes, yeah, she and Evie both have the same birthday. My daughter and my mom have the same birthday. Isn't that neat? Okay, let's get started. You ready to sing? I've got some good birthday books to read today and a birthday song to sing. And um, I've got all my birthday decorations up here. I'll show you those in a minute. But let's start with our good morning song. You ready to sing? I am. Here we go. Hello, everybody. And how do you do? How do you do? How do you do? Hello, everybody. And talking about celebrating birthdays. Sometimes at a birthday party you wear a hat. Can you make your hands in the shape of a birthday hat on top of your head like a triangle? Oh, that's a good one. A birthday hat. And sometimes at a birthday party you might have a little noise maker in your mouth. He goes, Ooh. everybody pretend they're holding a party noise maker and make a birthday party noise. Ooh. Yay! And sometimes birthdays are a surprise or you might get a surprise present. Can you show me your best surprise face? Oh my goodness. Maybe you unwrapped something that you didn't expect to get that you really like. Or maybe you see somebody at your birthday celebration that you didn't think you were going to see. And that's really surprising. Yes! Any day can be full of surprises, but birthdays are sometimes extra special that way. Hello everybody and how do you do? How do you do today? Before I put down my ukulele, let's sing our ABCs together. Here we go. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J,
Let's take a look at my birthday decorations on top of my piano. Let me see how I can do this. I've got my phone flipped around again so that you'll be able to see the words in my books. I've got this special balloon wreath. I made that when Evie turned one and it's a bunch of balloons that aren't blown up stuck into a wreath. So it's the shape of a circle and we hang that up when somebody's having a birthday. Look at these, I've got two special birthday cards here. I wonder who they're for. We'll have to take a look at that later. I've got a special birthday box. Maybe there's a present in there, I don't know. I've got my birthday dinosaurs here ready to party. Look what my kids did. They put googly eyes on this Triceratops. Doesn't he look funny? And I've got a Brachiosaurus and a T-Rex. They're here to help us celebrate today. And I've got some sparkly ornaments and a pretty garland. We're all set to party. And I've got our two books that we're gonna read today. Happy Birthday Hamster. And Mary wore her red dress and Henry wore his green sneakers. So let's start with a book. Let's do, let's start with Happy Birthday Hamster. Look at that. Happy Birthday Hamster by Cynthia Lord, <clears throat> excuse me, illustrated by Derek Anderson. Happy birthday, hamster. Look, there's hamster's mailbox. Ooh, where is it? There it is. Sometimes if you get birthday greetings, they might come in your mailbox to your house. Best day, bake day, candles on a cake day, clap day, cheer day, party time is here day. Do you know what today is? Yes, today is my shopping day. First, I need to stop at the bakery and buy some pink cake, blue cake, chocolate through and through cake, short cake, tall cake, cannot eat it all cake. Which would you choose? <gasps> Look at all of those different cakes in the cake shop. Which one would you choose? Oh my gosh, look at the tall ones in the back. Oh, let's see. I am getting a message here. Let me take a quick look. Let me pause, boys and girls. Yes, Vanessa, I got that message. We're all set. <laughs> look at this really tall cake in the back. I kind of like this short one. Oh man, I'm still getting used to this. I kind of like this short one here with the fruit in the middle. That might be tasty. Maybe that's like strawberry or raspberry or something. Oh, I want, the hamster says, I want the biggest one. It has the most frosting. Looks yummy. But today I came to buy dog biscuits. Oh, hamster thought his friend was gonna pick out a cake. He's just buying dog biscuits, okay. Now I need a new ball. Our next stop is the toy store. <gasps> Hamster says, I love toys. <clears throat> Look at these funny mice back here. I wonder what they're up to. That one's got a checklist. This one's riding on a wagon with a cake. Well, let's see what happens here. Spin toys, glow toys, wind it up and go toys, soft toys, hard toys, ride it through the yard toys. Which would you choose? Wow, look at all of those toys. Which one would you choose? <gasps> I might pick something I could ride on. That bike right there, that looks pretty fun. Look, Hamster's looking. He's trying to pick which one he would like. <clears throat> oh, look, Hamster says, I want a riding toy. And his friend says, this ball is perfect. Wait. Aren't you forgetting something? Yes, you're right. I need to buy a card for a friend. Let's stop at the party store. Oh, hamster's confused. He thinks his friend is buying something for him and he's really just getting the things on his list. Games, check. Hats, check. Pinata and some bats, check. 
Plates check, spoons check, streamers and balloons check. Which would you choose? Oh, look at Hamster. He's looking at all the things. Good morning, Emerson. He's looking at all the things, the balloons. Look at that stack of party hats. That's just like the party hat we made at the beginning in the shape of a triangle on our head. <clears throat> Look, a balloon. How fun. Grab it and let's go. I just have one more stop. Curly fur, straight fur, awesome, groovy, great fur, striped fur, white fur, looking quite a sight fur. Which would you choose? Oh, look, they're getting their fur all done for the party. They seem to be collecting party supplies anyway. Look, there's all kinds of pictures of hairdos that they could have. Hamster's getting his hair combed and his friend's getting a little trim. Let's see what's happening here. Oh, look, his friend says, you look groovy, great. Thanks. Now I finished all my errands. Time to go home, I guess. Hamster's sad. Long day, late day. All I did was wait day, frown day, fret day. How could they forget day? Poor hamster. Do you want to come in? Sure. Oh, wait, look there in the window. What's happening? there in hamster's house can you tell what's gonna happen it looks like some of his friends are in there waiting <gasps> surprise oh, look how surprised hamster is his friends were tricking him I thought you forgot I would never forget my best friend's birthday Cake time, hat time, hit it with a bat time, game time, race time, paint it on your face time. Which would you choose? Good morning, Dominic. Look at all those fun things to do at the party. Pin the tail on the donkey. There's a pinata. Oh wait, look, pin the tail on hamster's friend. Watch out, look, this little guy over here, he's hitting his bat in the wrong direction. He's gonna hit his friend and thinks that that's the pinata. Oh, there's friends up here playing with a racetrack. Oh my gosh, what a fun party. Happy birthday, hamster, make a wish. Good morning, Kerrigan and McKenna, hi, Claire. All my friends are gathering. Red box, brown box, sparkle up and down box. Tall box, wide box, what could be inside box? <gasps> Which would you choose? Look at all the different shaped boxes. <gasps> Which one would you pick if you could pick one present? Let's see which one hamster picks. <gasps> oh, look, he says, thank you. Look at all, look, he got the riding toy. There's a robot. It says the end. That's the end of our story. So it turned out okay for Hamster. His friends tricked him and then they threw him a special party anyway. That's a nice story. I like that one. Oh, and look, there's another book about Hamster. It's called Hot Rod Hamster. That looks like a good one. Good morning, Winnie. Good morning, Harper. Hi. All right. <clears throat> Happy birthday, hamster. That's a good one. Um, let's do, you know what? Let's, let's jump right over to squeeze out the grease. This is like, seems like prime squeeze out the grease time here. All right, and I don't, we're still, I'll tell you what. Hi, Livia, how are you? All right, let's do some squeeze out the grease. And make sure that you've got a place that you can move where you're not gonna bump into a grown up or a pet or a brother or sister or some furniture. Make sure you've got some room to move around, okay? Um, hmm, okay. I think I've got some good ideas. Yes, I do. Okay, I'm ready. You ready? You've got your grease ready? Here we go. Squeeze out the grease. 
slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks, and climb a tree somewhere. Are you climbing up and up and up and up and up higher? When you get to the top, hold on to a branch and look down. Does everything look much smaller from up there? And let's climb down. And if you can't climb down and you think you can jump, you can do that too. All right, I hope everybody's on their feet. Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks, and blow out your birthday candles somewhere. out your candles let's do one more I don't think we got all the candles ah good now they're all blown out squeeze out the grease slick back your hair pull up your bobby socks and be surprised to see a friend right there yay what's your best surprise face Do you cover your eyes because you can't believe it? Ah! Do you just go, oh, because you can't believe your friend is there? <laughs> that would be fun to see a friend at a party. That would be a nice surprise, wouldn't it? Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks, and move like, oh, I'm getting inspiration. Move like a T-Rex somewhere. Can you take big steps? <gasps> can you take big steps, but can you make your arms really close to your body? Keep your hands really close because they have little short arms. <laughs> Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks. Oh, and let's move like a Brachiosaurus somewhere. They're going to take big steps but then they're gonna stop in one place and reach their neck up and eat leaves off the tree. So we'll take a couple big steps, big steps, and then we'll stop and we'll reach our neck up high. And take some bites of yummy leaves off the trees. Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks, and take tiny little steps somewhere. <clears throat> Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks, and sneak somewhere. planning a birthday surprise for somebody else, you might need to sneak. One more. Squeeze out the grease, slick back your hair, pull up your bobby socks and dance somewhere. birthday parties. This is one of my favorite books. Mary wore her red dress and Henry wore his green sneakers, which doesn't sound like a birthday story, but look on the front cover. Where are these friends? They're at a birthday party. So let's find out how they get there and how Mary's red dress and Henry's green sneakers tie into the story. So this is adapted from a song and illustrated by Meryl Peak. So this is a song that already existed, but then this person put it in a book and drew these 
pretty illustrations and you'll see how the color how the color works in to the illustrations it's very shadowy down here where i can see i hope that you can see all my pictures all right here's the dedication page it says for michael and jolie and you can look right here let's see where is she see right there there's mary she's walking on a path that's where she's headed. Uh oh, somebody just sent me an angry face. I hope that that was a mistake. Mary wore her red dress, red dress, red dress. Mary wore her red dress all day long. See, everything is black and white, except now Mary's red dress is red. Henry wore his green sneakers, green sneakers, green sneakers. Henry wore his green sneakers all day long. And there's Henry catching up with Mary. Look, and there's something else that's red there. Hi, do you want to listen to the story? Yeah. Okay. Katie wore her yellow sweater, yellow sweater, yellow sweater. Katie wore her yellow sweater all day long. There's Katie. She's coming out to greet Henry and Mary. I think it's Katie's house that they're going to. But see, now they've got all the different colors that we've already sung about. Red and green and yellow. All right. Mommy. Ben wore his blue jeans, blue jeans, blue jeans. Ben wore his blue jeans all day long. Oh, what's happening? Look at Katie. She's opening a funny thing. Have you ever seen one of those things? Have you ever seen one of those things? No? With like little um, things inside that have springs. And you, you push them down in the can and then screw the lid on. Mom, and then I'm somebody, gonna... no, I got you, honey. And then somebody opens it and they pop out. That is quite a surprise. Maybe your mom or dad had one of those before. Amanda wore her brown bandana, brown bandana, brown bandana. Amanda wore her brown bandana all day long. Do you want to take this into Abby? No. Okay, what are you watching? Are you watching? What are you watching? Okay. Ryan wore his purple pants. What? Did you see something back here you liked? Yeah. What? That. Look at Amanda. What's Amanda about to do? She's playing a game. She's blindfolded. And what's she going to do? She's going to step into the little frog pond. Ryan wore his purple pants. Purple pants. Purple pants. Ryan wore his purple pants all day long. Oh, my goodness. Look, that party is really getting exciting. Hey, Ev? Yeah. Can you come here for a second? Let's see what Evie's wearing today. Because it's Evie's birthday. What are you wearing today? Nothing. You're wearing nothing? I don't think you're wearing nothing. I just wanted to see what you were wearing today since it was your birthday. Evie's wearing blue jeans. Evie's wearing a black shirt and a hat. Can I show everybody your hat? <gasps> Evie's wearing a hat a, and a black shirt. And Kieran's wearing a blue shirt and green pants. Nice. No, let me go. All right. Stacy wore her violet ribbons, violet ribbons, violet ribbons. Stacy wore her violet ribbons all day long. There's Stacy. Oh, look. Sometimes a party is full of games. Karen. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'll be back. Can you just grab him like a little snack or something? I'll get, I'll get you a snack. Yeah. Let's get some pretzels. Or some, or some chocolate. Do you want some chocolate chips? Kenny wore his orange shirt, orange shirt, orange shirt. Uh oh. Kenny wore his orange shirt all day long. Look at 
look at Kenny. What kind of animal is Kenny? He's a porcupine. Uh-oh. And look what happened to Stacy. Her balloon popped on one of Kenny's quills. Oh, okay, now here. This is tricky, are you ready? Here's a little challenge. Who wore a pink hat, pink hat, pink hat? Who wore a pink hat all day long? Do you remember who was wearing the yellow sweater? And who has the pink hat? Hi, guys. Sorry. That's okay. It's all right. That's okay. I'm almost done. I'm just finishing the story. I want everybody to be able to hear because I'm at the very end. Yeah. Asking who yeah. wore the pink hat. Ow. Uh-oh. Look at, look at Katie's mom and dad. Or Katie's mom and her grandma. They're relaxing. Oh, yeah. Katie wore the yellow sweater. And does Katie have the pink hat on? Yeah. Let's see. Katie wore a pink hat. Pink hat. Pink hat. Katie wore a pink hat all night long. Oh, look, Katie's sleeping in her birthday hat. Oh. Hi, guys. Okay, listen. I'm finishing up my class, okay? I just read a couple of books. And I was actually thinking I have just a couple more things to do, okay? I have a couple more things to do. Would you like to stay with me while I do them? No. Okay. Well, the first thing I think we're going to do, hi, Natalie. The first thing we're going to do, I think, is count to 10. Will you count to 10 with me? Yeah. Yeah. And today is a special count to 10 day because remember, that's how old Evie is. She, that's how old she's turning today. All right. So let's count to 10 together. Ready? One, two, and here. We go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And you know what? Remember my four. Excuse me. That's a book called Happy Birthday Hamster, and I'd be happy to read it to you when we're done. But right now, I have to show everybody these birthday cards. Remember at the beginning, I had these special birthday cards? Let's see who they're for, because they were just up here on my piano. Thank you. Will you help me? No. No. I have two birthday cards, one with a cake. Look at that one. With a cake. Look, do you see how many candles are on the cake, Kieran? One, two... Three. Three candles. And look, it's got three layers. And this card has a big present on the front. What do you think is in there? Well, let's open it. Hold on a second. Let's open this one. It says, happy birthday. <gasps> and it's got some names inside. Let's see. These are all people who had a special day in March. <laughs> Happy birthday, Tyler, Luke, Claire. Oh, buddy. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay, honey. Do you want to hold this for me? Yeah. Tyler, Luke, Claire, Daniel, Emma, Briella, Lydia, Mina, Luca, Ella, Eamon, and Christopher. Mina and Eamon are brother and sister, and their birthdays are in the same month. We hope you had a great day. Isn't that nice? All right, now let me see this one with the present. You hold the one with the cake, and I'll hold the one with the present. Let's see who this one is for. It's for our friends having April birthdays. Happy birthday, Tegan, Helena, Lucas, Livia, Mackenzie, Owen, Hunter, Riley, Evie, and Grammy. That's my mom. She's my kid's Grammy. So I put her birthday in there too because these are all of our friends having April birthdays. Wishing you lots of birthday fun. Give me a balloon. Oh, I can't. Those are stuck on there forever. Thank you for coming here today. I hope that you had fun celebrating birthdays. You know what we should do? Before we leave, we have to sing happy birthday. So if you're having a birthday today or somebody you know is... This song is for you. You want to sing? Ha oh, bless you. Happy no, birthday no, 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 no. to you. 
Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear friends. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Thanks for coming here today, here today, here today. Thanks for coming here today. We'll see you next time. Thanks for coming here today, here today, here today. Thanks for coming here today. We'll see you next time. Happy birthday. I hope you had a happy birthday in March or in April or have a happy birthday coming up in April. And I'll see you next Wednesday morning. Thanks for playing. Bye.